Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, it's Hope. For today's video, I'm going to show you guys what's new in my wardrobe for fall, basically a collective haul, and I have a lot of items to show. So I don't want this video to be too long, so I'm just going to skip the long intro. So the video will be by brand, and the first one is H&M. So I picked up this varsity style jacket, and this one is not a super thick material, so it's perfect for fall or summer to fall transition. And I got this in a size large to have that oversized fit. So the next item is also a varsity jacket, and this one was a little bit more expensive than the blue one, but it is thicker. And I love this color, it was a size medium. If you can't tell, these sleeves are made out of a faux leather material. So next from H&M, I picked up two different blazers. So the first one is like this tan color. This is a size extra small. And then the other one I got is in this gray color. It's also a size extra small. Also pretty oversized naturally, but I would say that the brown one runs bigger than the gray one. So the last two tops from H&M are the same thing, just in different patterns. So the first one is this purple one. I like the shape of the bottom. I feel like it's pretty flattering. And this has a mock neck. It's a ripped material and I got a size extra small. White one is also an extra small. Same exact thing, ripped material with that same detail at the bottom. And they do have some stretch, but I would say they're true to size. Also forgot to mention that they have thumb holes, which I love that. So next up is Urban and and these items were sent to me, but this video is not sponsored. So I picked up two different dresses. So the first one is this mesh material bodycon dress. And even though it's mesh, it has a slip underneath, so it's not see-through. And this was a size extra small. It fits perfectly. And then the other dress that I got from Urban is this blue bodycon. And I would say this runs really small or runs short. I think this with a oversized blazer on top would be really cute. I got one sweater from Urban and this is actually a men's product I believe. And this was a size small and I think this would be really cute with a black mini skirt, some loafers. So the rest of the items from Urban are bottom. So I picked up a camo pant. And I believe this is from the vintage line. So the only thing I would say is it did come with a really strong smell. It is a little bit long on me, so I do have to fold it about four to five inches. One thing I really like is the waistband is adjustable because they have these little pull strings on the side. So I picked up another pair of baggy jeans. If you guys watch my favorite jeans video, I mentioned that the BDG baggy jean is one of my favorite styles of denim. So I wanted to pick up this cream one and this has distressing on both of the legs. This was a size 24. I get a 24 in all of BDG denim because I find that they all run pretty true to size. The only thing is it is a little bit long on me so it does scrunch at the bottom. So I got another pair of bottoms similar to that color. This one is a corduroy material. I actually have this in two different colors. They're one of my favorite pants. They're super comfy. So it's just a high rise with a wide leg. And this is a size 24, like I said, beauty G is all pretty true to size. And then the last item from Urban is a pair of joggers. These are also a men's item, but I find that it actually fits really well. This is a size extra small and I love the color of this. I've already worn this a bunch of times. The last two items from Urban are just accessories. I picked up two different baseball hats. Just wanted to stock up on some different colors. So I got a black one and then a blue one. So next up is Nordstrom and I just have a couple of items to show. I actually did a haul with them over on TikTok. So I'm just gonna go ahead and show some of my favorite items. So the first one is a pair of jeans. I got a lot of denim from them, but this was my favorite one that I got. It's a carpenter style jean because it has that loop on the side and it just has a wide leg fit. And this is how the back pockets of the jeans look. And then the other item from Nordstrom is this flannel. And this is probably the softest flannel that I own. It's super comfy. And I got a size extra small on this, so it does run oversized already. So I have one item from Boohoo, and it's just this varsity jacket. So I picked up the red one, but they had a bunch of different colors. And then the sleeves are a faux leather material. This is how the back of the jacket looks. And I got this in a size small, and it is pretty oversized. So I have one item from Revolve, also a pair of cargo style pants. It is a little bit long on me, so I would probably have to fold them or get them altered. Adjustable thing that the cargo pants had, so you can cinch it in. And for reference, I got a size extra, extra small. I'm usually 24 in jeans. Next up is Prince of Polly, and all the items are kind of a mix of some things that they sent to me for a collab, and then some of them I did purchase on my own. So the first one is this flannel. I love this color, but the only thing is it is a little bit of an itchy material. So this was a size extra, extra small or a US zero. And I think it's the perfect amount of oversize. So the next two items are kind of similar. They're both button up style tops. So the first one is this 
zebra mesh material and this is also a size extra extra small it is a pretty stretchy material by the way and then the other one is this green one this is not a mesh material so it's not see-through and i love this color they had a bunch of color options actually so this is a size us zero it's pretty stretchy as well so this other top is kind of similar to that zebra one it's a mesh material the size us zero in the material is pretty stretchy as well and it just has this tight detail in the center so this next top is kind of hard to see just holding up but it makes more sense when they try on it's a one shoulder black top and it has this little cutout on one side this one i got a size us2 it has some stretch to it and i just paired these with a pair of black leather pants also from princess polly i have five different bottoms from princess polly they're one of my favorite places other than yes style to get bottoms just because i feel like they fit really well so the first one is denim and it's just this red tie-dye print this is a size us zero and i would say it fits true to size and then this is how the back looks this is a kind of a thinner material so the next pants is also a pair of denim and this is probably one of my favorite items that i've ever gotten from princess polly it's just the perfect baggy jean it has two little rips on the knees and this was a size us zero i would say it runs true to size there is no stretch and this denim material is a little bit thicker than the red ones so this one is this newspaper print and it's it's kind of feels like denim material and I actually got this one in size US2 instead of US0 and it does fit really well. Two more pants from Princess Polly. So this one is this corduroy material in this dark olive green color and so it's made out of a corduroy material. It does have a little bit of stretch, not really on the waist but on the legs it has a little bit of stretch and this was a size US0. It fit really well but the length was a little bit on the longer side so I did have to fold them around four to five inches, I would say. Last pair of bottoms from Princess Polly are these faux leather ones in this green color. And this is kind of a mid-rise, I would say. It has a little bit of stretch to it, like size US zero. The two different sneakers, and the first one is a pair of New Balance 550s. So they have a couple different colors in this one, and I chose the navy one. And then the other pair of sneakers I have, I've actually already worn them out quite a bit. It's a pair of Balenciaga track sneakers in the all white color. And this is a size 36. I got it from Forward, and they actually had a 15% off coupon, which is why I ended up getting them. So I think the coupon might still be active, so I'll just put it in the description box. Because of the coupon, I actually got a Balenciaga bag as well. I don't have it with me downstairs. That one was also from Forward. I got 15% off of it, so that saved a lot. It's actually the perfect size. It fits a lot more than you would think because it looks tiny, but it fits a lot. So the last store I have is YesStyle, and I'm going to go through these items pretty quickly because my camera is going to die soon. So the first item is this Varsity jacket, and this is a thinner material. And for quality, I would definitely say the H&M ones do feel nicer. But if you are on a budget, this one is still really cute on just for like the aesthetic or the look of it and everything from yes style is a size small or one size so i got one sweater it's just this oversized striped one it feels pretty good quality for yes style. i feel like their knits are usually pretty good compared to like their regular items so i decided to try out their blazer so the first one is this black one and it is an oversized fit it is a little bit wrinkly right now so i would definitely have to steam or iron this so the other blazer that i got from yes style it unfortunately did not work out it was a little bit too oversized and i feel like the shoulders don't sit at the right spot i still wanted to show you guys because i was still happy with the actual item the issue was just with sizing so it may work for you so i'm going to move on to bottoms for your style i'm going to start with my trousers i picked up two different ones and the first one is a basic black trouser and it has an oversized baggier fit this one is a perfect fit on the waist and for reference i'm a 24 and this is a size small and then the other trousers are these gray striped ones and i love the fit of this one as well it fits perfectly on the waist it is more of an oversized fit and it has pockets and everything like that another pair of black bottoms these are just flare style pants it has this little cutout detail on the front and it is stretchy as well as a size small it's a thinner material similar to that swimsuit material that most of the tops were made out of so i picked up a pair of denim and these are just these it's just these tan jeans and it's a plain leg so no rips and the bottom is actually a raw hem one thing to know is this is a thinner denim so and then i got another pair of cargo 
pants from Yesstyle. These are these brown ones and it just has a cargo style fit with the pockets. This is how the back pockets of the pants look. So two more bottoms from Yesstyle. The first one is a pair of printed pants and it's a flare style. So it is a perfect length. The fit is actually perfect and it's really comfortable. Just know it is a little bit on the thinner side so you have to be careful with what you wear underneath. Definitely don't want to wear anything super bright or printed. The last bottom is this faux leather one with this lace up detail. Unfortunately, these didn't really work with the length. It's a little bit too long on me, which I was surprised about because yes, so pants, usually the length is fine. If you're a little bit taller than me or have longer legs, this might be a perfect option. A little black mini skirt. It actually has a skirt, so it has shorts underneath and it is really comfortable. It kind of feels like an athletic skirt. It has a little zipper detail in the back. It's stretchy and one thing to know it is super short, but because there's shorts underneath, I don't really mind. So I'm going to move on to the tops from your style. I'll go through these quickly. So all the size small by the way. So this one is just this graphic top. It's a pretty soft and comfortable material. It is stretchy. And this other one is also a printed material. It is super stretchy. It has cutouts on the front near the chest and also on the sleeves. I would say it's kind of like a swimsuit material. If you're familiar with Yes Style items, you probably know what I'm talking about. So this one is also kind of like that swimsuit material. It's just this zebra printed top. The back is actually open and it has this tie detail. So then I have this one. It just has that cutout in the front. It's kind of like a reddish brown color. So the next one has these really cool cutouts and then a off the shoulder on one side and it is a really thin material but it is comfy and soft i do think it's a fun unique top i haven't seen anything with this cut and then this next one kind of similar to that green one it has that same cutout and it has these little slits on the sleeves and the green one also had that forgot to mention but it's a swimsuit like material it's stretchy and actually fits really well i've seen tops like this on pinterest with the little cutouts but i never know where to get them so i was happy to find them on yes style three more long sleeve tops so they're all printed and this one is a button up style top it's a mesh material i do wish it was a little bit more form fitting i feel like it's not super flattering to my shape versus something like this is a little bit tighter so i feel like it's more flattering last long sleeve top is this button up style top and i'm still not really sure like how i feel about this I don't know if the print is a little bit too crazy for me. Material is a little bit weird. It's that swimsuit material, but I feel like tops like this are usually not that kind of fabric. So I got one dress from YesStyle and it's a sweater knit material. I love the length of it. Obviously it's a tank top, so it's not really a fall dress, but I think because of the knit material, it's a good transition piece to layer something on top. So this other item is not a fall item either, but I was planning to wear them with trousers or either just layer a brown blazer over it. So, I, so the last couple of tops are either just t-shirts or tank tops. So definitely not really fall, but I figured I would just show them in case you guys are interested. So I have this printed graphic top and it's a size small. It is a stretchier material. It is thin, but it is comfortable and the back is just a plain black. So this next one, I actually saw something like this on a virtual stylist that I follow on Instagram and she styled an outfit with this. So that's why I wanted to pick this up. And then I also have this red one with this leopard edge and heart. So the last two tops from Yesterday were just tank tops. And the first one is just this white, graphic tank top it's a ribbed material it has this lace edge and then this other top i just got because i have the black version and i really like the cut of it so i wanted to pick up the white one as well just has this little ring detail it's made out of a swimsuit kind of material 